Fantastic. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Uh, how does the weather this weekend affect you at all? I know you played up there, right, Washington? Uh, in college, yeah. I actually played in a rainy game too. But I mean, just making sure you have the right shoes on, and obviously traction is a thing. But other than that, just coming in with the same mindset every every game. How do you practice for that? Um, I mean, you can't really recreate rain. <laughs> So just mentally kind of getting your body uh, right, knowing that, you know, you might have to wear different shoes or, you know, making sure you have the right shoes to be able to not uh, slip on the field. But other than that, just, just come ready to play. Also, every week presents a different challenge as a cornerback, especially against these elite receivers. But do you look forward to some matchups more than others, or do you kind of keep it all pretty much the same? Yeah, I try to just keep, you know, every week come in and give them my best. Um, you know, not try to overplay or underplay, depending on who you're playing against. Just try to come in and compete every week. When you see Metcalf on film, what are, what are the things you see? Uh, he's a big, fast, physical dude, um, quick, right? Seemingly has all the attributes, so definitely a good receiver and somebody that you look forward to competing against. Man, I guess same with Lockett. Yeah, just a smaller version, but still quick, fast, and run all the routes, you know, uh, protect the top off the defense. So really got to have good eyes uh, when you're covering them. You got to face mobile quarterback after mobile quarterback. How much does that, I guess, attune you to facing another one? Does it kind of condition you to, to the things you're going to have to see? Yeah, for sure, especially with this team. Uh, you know, we always see their receivers staying alive downfield, um, broken play. Next thing you know, they throw it down the field for 20 yards. So just make sure you have good eyes again. How much of a challenge is it with a mobile quarterback? I mean, obviously, it, it extends how long you guys have to cover. Exactly. So. You might have to cover somebody for a little bit longer, but again, that still all goes back to having good eye control, um, making sure you don't look up at the quarterback for too long, get your eyes back to the receiver. Clear? Clear? I believe we're good. All right. Good to go.